So you might be trying to figure out how you can change your app icons inside of your iPhone. Now, if you're running iOS 18, it's a fairly simple, basic process. Now, there's a couple things you can do here. If you want to change your app icons, like the actual icon itself, I'll show you how to do that in a second. But if you want to get just tweak them and make them different or whatever, you can hold down on an application right here and you can tap on edit home screen. And then what you want to do is you want to tap on edit in the top left corner and you want to go and click on customize. So when you do that, you'll see this type of page come up and you can change your icons from being these smaller icons like these ones to these larger icons. Personally for me, I think these larger icons look so much better. You can also change the way they look to light mode, to dark mode, to automatic, to tinted if you want to tint them to a completely different color. You can kind of customize this whichever way you want to and it's really cool that you have that type of capability. Now if you want to change... Now, if you want to change your actual app icon, what you're going to want to do is you want to first download an icon that you like. So in this case, you can download any of the app icons. You can just find one online. Most of the time, I just type in like app store icon and then just kind of see which one I like there. So there's a lot of different app icons you can basically choose from. So find the one that you like and then just download it or get it the proper way. But in this case, we'll just use this one. Now, next up, we want to make our way over to our shortcuts application. So find shortcuts and you want to go ahead and open it up. Now here, what you're going to want to do is you want to click on the shortcuts panel or the automation panel, whichever one you want, and you want to click on the plus button in the top right corner. Now, when you do that, you're going to come into this page. What you want to do is you want to find the open app button, which is right here. So you want to tap on open app and you want to go and click on the app that you want to open up. In this case, it'll be the app store. So tap on the app store. And when you have this up, you're basically almost done. What you want to do is you want to click on the share button that's in the bottom right corner, which is right here. And all you're going to want to do here is you want to click on add to home screen. So click on here. And then what you can do is you can go ahead and basically click on whether you want this type of widget. I guess you can do widgets now, or if you want to do a photo. So now you can go and click on choose photo and you can choose that app icon that we just downloaded. So in this case, it's getting a little glitchy. I don't know why it's not allowing me to choose that one, but in this case, I'll just choose a different app icon. I'll just literally, you can choose whatever app icon you want. Let's say I wanted it to be this one or whatever. So I can go and have it as this, for example. So then what you want to do is you want to click on choose, and then you want to go and click on add, and that will go and add that as the app icon right there. So now when you click on it, it'll go ahead and give you that annoying pop-up, but it will open up the application, and that's it. So now you just rinse and repeat. You can just keep doing that over and over and over again. And that's basically how you do it. It's a very basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, hold on.